In the metal squadron, taking a look at the July copper contract, which had a recovery week. Copper is up over 2.4% this week and over 4% since the May 12th low close. First week higher for copper since the week of April 4th, although we finished lower today by about a third of a percent. Four spot 2690 was the settlement price area on the low 42505. That was down three quarters of 1%. And then on the upside, we're actually up over 1% today. Four spot 3275, 1.03% higher than yesterday's settlement of four spot 2830. So overall, a recovery week for copper, a nice little recovery for the copper lungs. Now, potential demand is part of the driver on the long side of things in the short term. China's very focused on their reopening plans. They're still in effect with the zero COVID strategy, but Shanghai specifically, and a lot of the different provinces of China are focused on reopening and getting the economy going again. This has spurred a little bit of hopes of potential demand coming from China, which of course is the largest consumer, largest smelter as a nation of copper. They've been out of the markets for a few weeks overall. They have stockpiled a little bit of inventory, but overall their demand has been depressed. And now people are expecting it to get a little bit better as they reopen. And then the supply side of things hasn't been bad, but a lot of copper smelters now are buying recycled copper and smelting it into new copper to stockpile supply for the next potential supply shortage or supply shock that goes with that increased demand. So overall, that means slightly higher to stable prices if that actually comes to pass. Today, though, down a third of a percent. Overall, up on the week for copper.